What's going on, YouTube? It's me, Super Tank, here again. And I got a box in the yard for the iPhone 6 for Boost Mobile. This is an iPhone 6 for Boost Mobile, guys. And let's get right into it. Well, we got the different box this year. I know y'all probably saw these in the other videos. Um, no iPhone look. It's just a pretty much a printout of the design. And on this side has an iPhone 6. Top is nothing. And another side, iPhone on there. No 6, I mean, just iPhone logos. Um, this is a 16 gig model. This will be, a, if I was mistaken, uh, be around 550 plus tax for new activations on Boost Mobile side. So you're paying outright for the device. You're not. Uh, you're not getting it subsidized like other contract companies like T-Mobile, AT&T, um, like other companies like that. You'll be paying, you know, like $99 or 199 on contract. And then, you know, you get the phone for a two-year contract. With Boost, you know, you're paying outright for the device and what it's worth. Um... In all honesty, you pay. I think you pay cheaper for this, buying it with Boost Mobile, than you is buying it at uh, another company like T-Mobile or Verizon, because you're financing those and then you're paying the one ninety nine and then like thirty dollars, thirty or forty dollars more a month for the phone. And then by the time you look at it, you know you done spent like six hundred for the phone, probably more, probably like six fifty. Let me see if I Apple really do good with these suctions. Give me one second. I'm gonna uh, pause it and then uh, get back. All right, so I got it. Here it goes. Here's the device. You have the phone right here in all its glory. It's the gold model, which you can see. Let's put this to the side. Let's see what comes in the box. All right, we got the regular. Uh, cut out for the device as well as a you know my um, camera hole now since the f the camera is protruding out in the back of the iPhone this time around with this new device all right so you get the regular standard stuff you get the um, their proprietary charger as well as the wall block and the he ear pods or headphones you want to call it just the regular stuff here nothing fancy uh, here's a booklet which uh, you, or you can take out your SIM card as well as Apple stickers and, and all the information you will need for the iPhone yeah, I don't see you know the big deal I've seen these things selling for crazy prices on eBay but eh should we stay on all right, so here's the device. It's pretty thin. Feels nice in the hand. Um, yeah, you know it's a. What's I mistaken? It's a 4.7 inch display, um, Retina display, which they like calling it. Pretty much a little over than 720p, I think, or maybe under <laughs> 720p, but I think it's around uh, 720p. Um, it's an 8 megapixel camera. Let's see if it focus. Come on, camera. This is probably be my last time recording any videos with this camera anyway. Man. I think you're not want to focus. Here's their camera, as well as the uh or the eyesight camera, it's like they're calling it. The tune tone flash. The uh, power on and off. It's different now from being up top. Now it's on the side. Um, as well as they take out the SIM card. It's pretty flush after that. Here comes the speaker as well as the charger. Um, noise cancellation mic or microphone pickup. Your 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. As well as the volume up and down. It's different this time around and more separated and, and pretty big. They feel pretty good in the hand though. Um, this is your silent button. Up top, there's nothing this time around. On the back, let's see if it focuses. It's an Apple logo. 
iPhone, all the information you need for the iPhone, and that's pretty much it. You know, uh, as well as your camera, your speaker, and as well as your fingerprint scanner. That's pretty much it. I make you comparisons to other devices that we have for Boost Mobile as well as Virgin Mobile. Um, this is the iPhone, excuse me, this is the Samsung Galaxy 5. They're pretty much similar in size, at least the footprint, but the screen on the Galaxy is much bigger. It's around 5.2 inches versus 4.7. Um, but the footprint is probably much about the same. Um, the thickness is thinner on the iPhone, but not by much. Or well, at least by not feel by much. Um, that's that. Here's the here's the um the LG phone that we got for Virgin Mobile as well as Boost. It's called the Volt. Um, it's around the same size screen, but the footprint of the LG phone is much thinner. I mean, excuse me, much smaller. Then this goes to the iPhone by far. Much thinner on the iPhone. Look at that. <laughs> iPhone's so thin. But the footprint of the device is this is much smaller. And about the same same exact same size screen, give or take. And here's another phone, HTC for Boost Mobile. It's a uh what's I'm mistaken, a four point three inch device. So that's pretty much it, guys. Um, I'm just going to do an unboxing of it, not a review. If you want to review, you can look at other guys' channels. Um, it's pretty much the exact same thing in any other iPhone. Um, just a different looking model, as well as a faster um, processor and everything like that. Um, still one gigabyte of RAM. Um, but that's pretty much it, guys. Hope you like, rate, and subscribe. Like I said, please like this video. It helps a bunch. As well as subscribe to my channel. I'll bring out more content like this in the near future. Thank you. Bye-bye.